Okay, hey guys, it is Stone Sunday, and I'm sorry this video was going up late again. I thought I did these videos, and it turns out I didn't. Um, can we get a focus? Can we get a focus? There we go. Okay, so basically what came out, let me put these cards away. Basically what came out is that now it's time to start doing. Now it's time. To, it's not time to figure out um, you are the creator. It's not time to figure out um, how you're connected to creation. It's not time to figure out if you can create. Now it's the time to get out there and create. And again, Mars is getting ready to go direct. And you're going to start to feel that hectic energy. You should probably start to feel a little now, like a little buzz, like you have to do something. You may be cleaning. You may, even if you're just sitting there watching TV, you feel like you have to watch this show. Or it, you starting to feel that energy a little bit where it feels like you have to do something. So, <coughs> excuse me. With that, I have uh, three stones that, well actually, Grizz works with this one more. But these two, <coughs> excuse me, I work with them. Um... And Grace actually takes this one to work with him. <sighs> I'm just getting really irritated by this non-focusing thing. There we go. Let's start with Hematite. Because this stone is Hematite. Hematite is known as a um, stone of the mind. It's it's a grounding stone, but but from Grizz working with it, he actually found out the stone actually helps him um, do his job better. Like gives, I guess, like mental clarity would be the best best way to say that. Um, <coughs> excuse me, it's going on my throat. <coughs> he actually noticed that you know he's he has a little bit more energy. He's a little more focused in doing what needs to be done and a little more clear on how it needs to be done when he works with the stone. So hematite is the first stone, and as you see, they are very magnetic. Now, from the from me working with hematite. The one thing I have noticed that if nothing else, these stones have a mind of their own, and not all stone, or not all hematite is meant for one thing. I actually use these stones with the pendulum, and <clears throat> these are not all the hematite we have, but I've actually used these stones with the pendulum, and some of them actually said they wanted to go to um, work with Grizz, someone to stay here, someone to go um, in our money manifesting jar, someone to go on our on our marriage altar. Like they all have, even though this one stone, they all had different things that they wanted to do. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, but yeah, this is a great stone to start off with when you're creating because they all have their own mind, they all have their own purpose, and they know where they should be and how they're supposed to help you. So, oh, my nails are dirty. Ugh, no, gotta fix that. Okay, so this stone is fluorite, which this one is a horrible. Well, actually, all my fluorites are kind of horrible right now. You can barely see um, the colors on them because I use fluorite a lot. Fluorite is great when you're working with computers and with me doing astrology readings and readings, um, channelings and all that. Most of my work, and now with me writing books, most of my work is done, well, actually all of my work <laughs> is done online and through computers. And fluorite is a great stone that helps keep that static energy out, that negative energy out. It helps with the, uh, uh, <coughs> the radiation the computer gives off. And this was, and just to help, just so you understand, when we first got this stone, this particular one, all this was purple, all this was green. You could not see through it. It was translucent a little bit, but you could not see through it like this. So this lets you know that the stone was was and is working, and I need to put it back where, where it was. Um, but yeah, fluorite is a great stone. <coughs> Excuse me, fluorite is known as the. Uh, most people say it's the genius stone. And it helps clear the mind, but I don't use it for uh, clearing the mind at all. I use it for, again, like I said, around the computer to help keep that static energy away, uh, the negative energy away, and, you know, just all the gooky stuff that comes with working with electronics. Fluorite, for me, is great with that. It keeps that stuff away. And the last stone is the bloodstone. Now, <coughs> oh, excuse me, what is going on? Now, the bloodstone is to me is a protective stone um most people say it's a stone of the, like a healing stone but to me where did you go why are you out of the camera there we go to me it's a very protective stone now, can you see the colors so you know it's a blessed stone I'm gonna hand out the way there you go you should be able to see the greens and the reds on it just want you to be able to get a good look at that okay so bloodstone to me is a very protective stone. I use it um, when I'm meditating, and <coughs> excuse me, and when I'm opening myself up to do readings for others. And I found it to be a great, you know, wall of protection, so that you can focus and have clarity and 
not a lot of things will come through that you don't want to come through and you can kind of well how I use it I use it so that when I open myself up only things that I call through the doorway because I have more than one blessed stone that I use only things that I call through the doorway could come through so it's a very protective stone for me and to me these are three great stones to start working when you start working with um, start manifesting creativity and start manifesting life the way that you want and start working on creativity as well as other stones that I can give you that will be great of course Celestite, I love Celestite, Cardillion um, <coughs> uh, those are two stones come up off the mind but I believe I used them in other readings I mean other stone Sundays and I wanted to show you different stones that you should be able to get um, I'm not sure about Bloodstone but these two stones you should definitely be able to get at a really good price um, without feeling like you're overpaying for them and f for almost all all or every budget that you can start using so with that it looks like my dogs are bothering me because they get hungry and uh, my children are bothering the dogs so it's time for me to go everybody have a blessed day peace